The first half of the season comes to a close on Sunday at Ipurua, where Eibar and Barcelona meet fresh from good games last time out. Finds it in the form of Andre Gomes, who was onside. Andre Gomes will cut this back. Shot is in from Luis Suarez with a scoring 1-1. Barcelona were back to their best in their win over Unión Deportiva Las Palmas. Luis Suarez's brace put him on top of the Liga scoring charts, level with Leo Messi. Messi equaled Raul González's record of getting goals against 35 different top-flight clubs. Through, pulled across by Rafinha, it's spilt again by Varas and put in. At the back, the Catalan club impressed with their ability to regain the ball and not allow Las Palmas to impose their game. That was one of our best games without the ball this season. With the ball, we were more effective in the second half, but in the first, we also created many chances. It was a great performance. Here's Barcelona on the run, Luis Suarez for his hat-trick, one on one with the goalkeeper. And Arda Turan fires in after Varas makes the save. In addition, fringe players such as Aleix Vidal, Arda Turan and André Gómez made the most of their minutes. That's good news with the run of important games that Barca have ahead of them. Through, Andre Gomez takes it on and fires it over the top. He did uh, almost everything right. It's with Luis Suarez who plays it over, looking for Andre Gomez, who's denied. We're aware that this is an important time, but we're up there. We're working well. We've had a little bad luck with a few draws but we've been showing our football, and I'm sure we'll fight until the end. Eibar come into the game off the back of a 3-2 win at the Molinon last weekend in a game that saw Adrián González shine. Pedro León found the net again against Sporting and is now Eibar's top scorer with six goals. Adrian Gonzalez goes for goal, and it was a fair shot. Rebound comes down, and Eibar have regained the lead. And it's Pedro Leon pounces on. We knew that it was a key game because Sporting are direct rivals. Let's not forget that even though we're having a good season, our target is what it is, and they were direct rivals. Fortunately, we took the three points, and now we have Barcelona coming up. We know they're not in our league, but we always try to make games at Iburua tough, and maybe we can take a positive result. The win in Gijón continued a great season for Eibar, who now have 26 points and lie in ninth place. They're practically matching their numbers from the previous two seasons in the first division. The Basque side have also taken points from the top two teams in the league with 1-1 draws. At home against Sevilla and away to Real Madrid. Despite being closer to Europe than to relegation, Eibar are still focused on survival above all else. We're only looking below us. We have 26 points. We're a game away from completing the first half of the season, and we're 14 points off the relegation zone. I think we're having a very good season. The team's in good shape, and we're always trying to compete. Injury hit Eibar will be without Ramis, Arbia, Junca and Kike Garcia. The main absentee for Barca is Javier Mascherano, who received his fifth yellow card of the season last weekend, meaning that Gerard Piquet will likely join Samuel Umtiti in the centre of defence. Barcelona have won all four of the meetings between the two sides in La Liga. At Iperua, Luis Enrique's side won 2-0 two, two seasons ago and 4-0 last time out, Leo Messi scoring a brace on both occasions. On their travels, Barca have dropped 16 points so far this season. 
Eibar want to continue racking up points and beat the Catalans for the first time in their history. There's no shortage of motivation for either side in the standout game of Match Day 19 in La Liga Santander.